And by the way, buddy, my name is Justin Hoodie. And thank you all so much for coming on my YouTube channel. Um, I'm very sorry for me to not actually if I make my own video basically because I have a nasty cough because I was sick and then I mean it feel better. Right now I have my throat is actually cleaning it out and I'm still coughing and coughing and coughing but I take a little by spray because I wanted to do like a video. But I did tell my parents and they by say if your coughing not go away into three weeks then we're gonna like take you to the hospital. Yeah, that is it by Oh, and the other thing too, when I look at my YouTube account, normally it's just by by three hundred and twenty eighth for now. By a very side, but then right now well it used to three hundred and twenty eight so but now it's three hundred and ten three hundred and ten eh, sorry, right. Normally it's three hundred and twenty eight. Now it's by like three hundred and twenty seven. Sorry, my draw. Yeah, that's kind of like confusing, you know. But I wanted to show you my custom Darth Vader lightsaber. You see, now you're probably wondering that did not look like Darth Vader lightsaber. That's more of like a like Revenge of the Sith or something. But you know about the commercial about the the battery or something like that, or like something like that, you know, the bunny, or like a drummer bunny, like in Star Wars commercial. I have like a video, like, even though YouTube will not allow me, but just hear me on it. I know there are no music, but, or sound, but just hear me out. Good night. I get it. And then hit ding dong the work. And check it. One battery. Get mad. And he threw his lights on the ground. I find a dark fear after his wife. Like, this is like Darth Vader. He might hold it like so, and then fall on the ground, and then kick it. Kick. Now, this is the one that I like, in, uh, mid, in like a new, sorry, because of the, the hot glue did not like, ruin it, but, wow, that was just like, Okay, I'm back. So I kind of know what Darth Vader was checking the battery and ends up by. Oh! Not Darth. Yeah, that is just like me. Okay, I'm just going to put E3000. And hopefully that will buy to stay. And I'm just going to put. Anyway, that's not what I'm going to do. Okay, so this is the Darth Vader lighter from the commercial. So I'm just trying to hold it that way. It doesn't even or come right off. I probably might just touch even there. That way the grip can actually by fall off. And there we go. Alright. Well, we cross our fingers. So, you're probably wondering how did I get the grips in the middle and the control box. Well, you know the little by Star, by Star Wars Darth Vader license from Revenge of the Sith? Kind of more by the dozen. I mean, 
You know about the other one where I customized the dark hair lightsaber toy in Empire Strike Back? Well, that doesn't even work, so I have to take that apart and then just like, I don't know. You know, like toys that just like getting old, kind of like fragile, and kind of like doesn't even want to work? So, this is actually like Darth Vader lightsaber from the commercial, the batteries in Star Wars. You know how my Darth Vader hold it, that part of that? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Here's that. But you cannot see it because it, ah, it's square. And you see the, that the bell clip. And then when Darth Vader was like, screwed it, you know, trying to check the battery, and you zoom right here, that the part of the, the screwed. You know, by, like, whoop, kind of like that. Whoop. Yeah, sorry. And then when you check the the battery, there was some screws on the the grips. And then the the, the the battery that I was telling you about, the one battery. Yeah, I figured. So, here she is. This is my homemade, customized, this is everything is some 3D printed. But, normally that I took apart the grips, the pommel, and the middle. And then I 3D print part of the dark Vader in the middle, like a whole body, I mean if I can do grips. And, you know by like, how by like, these little things? So I had to put my hot glue on it, that way it doesn't go on me. And then I put a big screwdriver, the black one, onto it. And then I just by... Well, technically I just by spray paint the, the top one and the bottom one using some black... Using, no, using metallic. I'll probably put it in the description of a well. Then they actually if I use like a D ring part of that, and then I use a control box part of the preventer sim, and then I put my three screws here, here, and here. You know, if, like Empire Strike Bad when the rips are actually falling apart, and they're like, "Oh no, what are we gonna do?" So they put ribbons or screws. You're trying to not make it happen. And then I just by spray paint the pommel and spray paint the the middle. And then once they dry, I did by use some mod pod sealer. And then I just put hot glue everything in place. And then I use some spray paint to paint it all the messy stuff. And then, if you're trying to like get the grips, the the hot glue, and then keep falling apart, always use Ether Thousand and some super glue. Right now, it's just like, ah, uh, it keep falling apart on me, but, that uh, again, okay. if you're like, don't feel like, like, uns but it's funny if I like, unscrew it. Yeah, when you try to avoid carefully, I'm like, uh, Really? That's the part of the lights of it, but we cannot actually see the the, the middle. That's what we main concern about. <coughs> yeah, here we go with my scratchy for clearing it out. But other than that, nothing else that we might have to say about this, so Yeah, so, yeah, that's all that I have, so, sorry, it should be, like, a short term. And if you don't actually have, like, a, a 3D printer, you can actually just use some, like, PVC pipe, like, go to Home Depot and then just get it, all that type of thing. 
But other than that, yeah. <coughs> <coughs> sorry. The scratchy ball. So it kind of a little bit, yeah, it kind of a little bit annoying. And if it doesn't feel better in the three weeks, my parents are going to like, take me to to the doctors and try to actually figure out what caused the problem. I mean, I did te I did my test and it was like 97.0, so I'm like pretty good for now, but I'm going to check on later today. I'm not very sure, but yeah, I hope you have a wonderful day. And remember, may the voice be with you.